family welcome back to my channel this is your girl Tierra and her she eats good how are you guys doing how y'all been I miss you guys I know I've been gone for a little bit you know just a vacation and with my family you know did a few things just living life y'all but I have missed you guys I just want to know what's been going on y'all gotta let me know the tea what's happening what's happening with y'all how y'all feeling today I really hope that all is well y'all I'm coming at y'all with a seafood mukbang today I have lobster tail I have Dungeness crab clusters I have snow crab clusters I have shrimp um and look y'all today's butter sauce <laughs> I'm trying this like well, I made it it's just like a spice it's like a spicy garlic butter sauce so I had a, I had a taste for a garlic butter mixed with some heat mixed with a teeny tiny bit of sweet so I created something in the kitchen so we're gonna see how that goes even though I have tasted it and it's good um, I have my lemons here on the side y'all before we get into this video I want you guys to go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up make sure you're commenting down below make sure you're subscribed to my channel and if you are subscribed make sure that bell is turned on so whenever I drop a new video you will be notified and also before we get started y'all already know what I asked y'all that's right How's our minds doing? Mine is clear, y'all. I'm telling you, my mind is very clear. How's your heart? How is your soul? How are y'all? I miss y'all. <laughs> As you get, I don't know if y'all can tell, my look, my voice is a little bit gone because we had so much fun this past weekend. So, but anyway, I am excited about digging into this food, y'all. I'm gonna sit one of these. I'm gonna sit this lobster bag here. Try to just bring some stuff down. You know what, y'all? I'm going to go ahead and start with one. Just because it's up here in my face looking all delicious. Yes, it is. Y'all already know what I did. Look at that. It's still hot. Got a little bit of the sauce up on it. Y'all, this, this sauce doesn't have onions in it, but it has a lot of garlic. I'm excited. Mm. I know it's going to be good. Look at, and it's so funny because I use whipped butter, y'all. And it's like creamy. Look at that. Y'all see that creaminess? I think I like that. I might gotta do whipped butter more often. My apologies, guys, y'all. I got choked up really, really, really bad on that sauce. It's crazy. I think the vinegariness, <clears throat> which I didn't even add a lot, is what choked me up. And I could not recover real fast. Like, I had to get up and really see about that. <clears throat> oh, my goodness. They ain't going to sauce trying to take me out. And it ain't the heat. It really, literally was like the vinegar went down the wrong pipe, y'all. And I told y'all, I get choked up. And it gets bad. And it just got really bad. But, I'm going to take another bite and see what happens. Mm. It's good. That is crazy. It's super delicious. <clears throat> mm. I like how creamy it is with that whipped butter. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. That's good. Mm. <clears throat> but anyway, now I'm like, should I add lemon? <clears throat> I don't know about that. I'm going to save that lemon for another day. <laughs> but what has been going on, y'all? But yeah, I was saying, y'all, I had went out of town. Y'all can hear my voice. It's basically gone. <clears throat> Y'all know how it is when you go out of town, you don't got your kids. For those of us who have kids, it's you and your spouse or your partner or whomever. <clears throat> y'all with family or wherever y'all go and y'all just having a good time. That's how the weekend was. Me and my husband, was with, we, was, we went to his um, family's um, house and stuff like that. We went to Virginia. That's where my husband is from. And, man... And I tell you, <clears throat> y'all, I'm sorry I keep doing that, but I was choked up just a second ago, and it's going to keep irritating my throat. So, I apologize for anybody who's like, why she keep doing that? <clears throat> I got, like, when vinegar or something spicy goes down my throat the wrong way, it chokes me out real, real bad. 
Mm. It's good. It's really good. But we went to Virginia with family. Oh my goodness, y'all. We had so much fun. So much fun. My husband's um <clears throat> cousin who house we went to really showed us a great time um <clears throat> and just all of us that went down we just really had a good time with each other <clears throat> i mean it was it was really fun um I have, I've been taking like some clarity days, I guess, if you want to say, just to, <clears throat> when my, like, when I'm like either not to say going through, but like when my mind is a little cloudy, I know my videos aren't going to be <clears throat> the same as if I'm like, you know, high spirit and stuff like that <clears throat> so sometimes y'all my absence could be due to that as well um <clears throat> you know i have children um you know it's a lot going on in some of my kids and camps and sports and <clears throat> all kind of things so i just be trying to find a balance with everything the, you know the the money to you know with this because y'all like I tell y'all the seafood ain't expensive is I mean it's not cheap I ain't gonna say it ain't expensive it's not cheap <clears throat> the time so um <clears throat> but just basically trying to balance everything um you know still make time for me and my own mind and peace and stuff like that so <clears throat> uh oh I done lost my lemon, y'all. And up here, it's just up here for decoration anyway. But, so sometimes my absence may be due to that too, y'all. Like, despite what anybody says, <clears throat> doing YouTube is definitely not easy and it's not for everyone. Meaning, like, it takes a lot. This is like, what? It being a job is understandable because you can't get paid from it. But some people be under the impression that you know it's as simple as just sitting in front of a of a of a camera and just eating and talking. But it's like no, nah. <clears throat> especially if you're trying to grow your channel and stuff like that. Like it's a lot that has to go into that. Um. So it just, you know, just trying to balance everything and <clears throat> making sure, like I said, at the same time, that my mental is good because <clears throat> I got to be, you know, for to be, you know, for my kids and <clears throat> my husband and stuff like that. Like, you know, the things I do off camera. So... But whenever y'all don't see me for a little while, just know that I'm living life or I'm getting my mind right. But I'll always be back. No fact. <clears throat> I will always come back because it's like when I do go a certain amount of time without like sitting with you guys, I do miss y'all like real life. It's so funny because I watch other YouTubers. And they'll say that. And I've been thinking to myself, like, well, at first, I'm like, how they miss us? They don't even know us. I get what they're saying. <clears throat> it's like miss being in that routine of, you know, having dinner with you guys. Like, yeah, we're looking at a camera, but <clears throat> once this video goes out, we're actually talking to y'all. You know what I'm saying? And stuff like that. Huh? How do I get to missing y'all? 
when I don't um spend time with you guys. So, uh oh, and y'all look, it's hot outside today. <clears throat> I have on a tank top. I mean, it's just a regular little, you know, a little regular tank top. Something I don't mind getting dirty because I know my shirt going to get dirty. But that's why my arms are out today. If anyone is wondering, it is hot. It got almost to 100 degrees today. So that's the thing. It be humid when it's hot, like sticky humid too. <clears throat> that's why my air is on I hope y'all can hear me good because I know my voice is gone like I told y'all from the turn up this weekend so oh excuse me but back to that y'all yes I had such an amazing time this weekend it was so much fun it was to celebrate my mother-in-law's birthday Aaron my um, husband's cousin's uh, wife's birthday. And man, when I tell you, it was a lit time. It was so much fun. <clears throat> it really was. But y'all comment down below and let me know what y'all been up to. Let me know about y'all situations and situations and vacations and all the shuns <laughs> <clears throat> I hope y'all summer is going good for y'all so far hitting the pool if y'all can't I know a lot of stuff is opening back up now going to the beaches or some water like I really do mm. <clears throat> I know the sauce almost took me out but it's so good <laughs> It's so good. It's, it really is, y'all. <clears throat> it is so good. I just don't know where to go. Go for the crab. Go for the crab. <laughs> oh, y'all. Also, I wanted to tell y'all, too. Um, my husband is starting a clothing line, so y'all will see me once it, um, I get some, some of the ladies wear. I will be advertising his clothing line. We're about to um, have his social medias for his clothing line up and running. So I will be able to link all of that information down below. Um, once we get, once, you know, everything gets together. But y'all, I'm so excited. <clears throat> like, just to see how passionate he is about this clothing line. It's so exciting to see and watch. Because, like I was telling him, like, you're starting something great and you know with patience and dedication and consistency it's going to be even greater <clears throat> so I'm excited for him and just you know his desire with it it's really awesome to see y'all have anyone in y'all life that's trying to do some type of business venture if they are in your life and they are somebody important to you please support them no matter what. <clears throat> Unquestionable support. Especially if you know it's something that's beneficial and it's, you know, progressing them. <clears throat> support them. Support don't even usually be costing money. Just, you know what I'm saying? Support looks like many things. Uh, a share on the social media. You know, talking about it to someone. That's support too. Support people who are close to you or people who are important to you with their business ventures y'all seriously I know sometimes we feel like you know a lot of our support may come from strangers which that's fine too but if you got family support your family 
<clears throat> you know what I mean? Support your friends. Support those, like I said, that's in your life, that's important to you. And if they trying to do something, support them. In whatever way that you're capable of doing. But support, nonetheless. And it's so cool because my husband is even, he's getting the kids involved in it and everything. I'm like, I was up. So y'all be on the lookout. When I start sporting his clothes, his clothing line. Like I said, once we get everything up and running, I will be letting y'all um, get to the information to be able to, you know, at least look at what he will have. <clears throat> and then from there, decide if it's for you. You know? <clears throat> y'all, this stuff is good. I would like it a little bit more spicy. But I ain't have like no um I know what I could have added, but I ain't even had no no I wanted to add some I added some chili oil, but that don't really give it too much spice. I wish I had some cayenne pepper. But it has a hint of spice which is not bad, but I wanted it to be more spicy, but it's pretty good. Mm-hmm. I don't like that whipped butter gives it like that. Like that creamy type of you know. Lift this thing up. Ugh. <clears throat> but. Mm. But yes, y'all really do hope y'all summer is going well so far. What's interesting is. One of my son's school called me the other day and was just like, my son got picked to join their summer camp at the school. And I was just like, oh, okay, that's dope. It's free. You know what I'm saying? And it's kind of like, on, on one hand, it's like supportive preparation for his next grade level. Um, keeping him active. And I'm like, that's fine. He wears his mask. Um, so I'm like, I'm, I'm good with that. So it got me kind of thinking like, maybe when school starts back, I might allow them to go back to the building. I'm going to see around that time what it, the numbers and stuff are looking like. And go from there. But he was excited to be like around his friends and stuff. <clears throat> he was like, I made a new friend today. I was like, oh, that's what's up. Because on one hand, I do miss their, you know, them being able to be sociable with people and not just <clears throat> in front of a computer. So. I'm trying to, I'm just trying to make a good decision and not a rash decision. If that, if anybody understands as a parent, you know what I'm saying? So, we're going to see. We will see. But, the only thing I'm hoping with their return to school is them not trying to shove the uh, notion of getting a vaccine down my kids throat because they're not getting vaccinated um and that's just my decision and the thing i don't understand with people especially when you do get vaccinated like they just don't understand why you don't want to and it's just like that's just my choice that's my decision the same way i'm not worried about you getting vaccinated be not worried about me not getting vaccinated that's how i feel because I'm going to take precautions for me and mine. 
regardless of who's vaccinated, who's not. But that's just something that I personally don't feel is necessary to be injected with. So I'm not getting it. My kids aren't getting it. And that's my decision. Um, I respect other people's decision. Like, I would wish people respect mine. But you know, you have some people who are just like, but I don't understand. Like, there's nothing to understand. It's just my decision. <laughs> don't don't stress yourself out trying to understand why I didn't do something that, you know, I guess you feel like I should have done. Because I could feel very strongly about you not feel like not needing to get that. But I don't. I don't push that off on anybody. You do what you do. What's comfortable for you and yours. But that's what I'm going to do. So. As long as that's not. A factor. Then they possibly could go back. But. And I mean. That's like I said. As long as they have the option to decline it or whatever. Then yeah, I don't have a problem with that. They, you know, they they've been wearing the mask, so wearing the mask ain't an issue. No. So we'll see. We shall see how that is going to go. <clears throat> mm. Shout out to all the. June, July birthdays. If your birthday is in June or July, comment it down below. I will shout you out. I surely will. Shout out to everyone who has a birthday in June and July. It's about to be July, but it's June now. Comment, let me know if you had a birthday or if you have a birthday coming up. Y'all, I cooked my um, seafood in like a garlic butter. Not that one, but like a regular garlic butter. Everything is just delicious. I mean, everything is really delicious. So. One of my favorite shows is back on. The show called The Shy. Mm. I love that show. I love it for entertainment purposes only. Like I said, it's controversy with everything. I get it. But I like that show for entertainment purposes. Truly. Watched the newest episode last night and it was good. Mm-hmm. I had a definite twist that you was you know how when you into a show and it's getting good, <clears throat> getting real good. And then it just do something different that have you like, oh my goodness, see this is why I love the show. <laughs> I thought like last night's episode was. It was just that same line. Like, what? It really was. <clears throat> I 
do y'all like um what kind of shows do y'all like comment and let me know i want to see like what type of stuff we have in common <clears throat> and i think um little power show is about to come back on with the story about Canaan, i believe this time So, I'm definitely, definitely going to watch that. Because I'm a huge power fan. Love this show. And I started, like I said, the power book actually took me by surprise. So, I've been watching that. So, got to continue. Got to see it through. But what do y'all some of y'all favorite shows though? Comment and let me know. I knew this was about to. Let me just move this out the way, y'all. I just knew that was about to. Um, and if y'all notice, I'm recording. It's still daylight. Mm. Cause here now we're gonna start getting dark to like what nine o'clock. Basically, I ain't want to wait that late. But now, when my son going to that summer camp, we back up at 7 o'clock. So, gotta get this one in early and get the ice video one in early. I haven't been, um, I haven't made a video for that channel neither in a few days. So, I heard I made one definitely more than this one, but it's been a few days. I think maybe before I went on vacation, like, out of town, <clears throat> on vacation, you might as well say, because it definitely was. Hmm. Trying to get the meat out, show. Oop, sorry, y'all. Saying, I got a little battery, but the charger is plugged up. And my phone trying to be messy. I got my phone plugged up to the charger and it's talking about low battery life. I don't even understand. But anywho, I'm probably gonna eat like ooh, a few more shrimp y'all. I'm gonna wrap it up. Your girl getting a little fully full. I don't like that. I like the way that the back of that shrimp look. No sir. <laughs> But I don't feel just saying. Or maybe not no more shrimp. Ah! <laughs> I'm just go ahead and finish this crab leg. <laughs> I ate all the shrimp, y'all. Thought I had some more. Usually they be hiding. Not today. Not today. Oh. Mm. Ooh. I had a piece 
piece of shell. Piece of shell. <clears throat> I wish I had some blue crabs, y'all. I ain't even gonna cap. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> if anybody watches me and you live in Virginia, in Richmond, and you like blue crabs, while we were there, my sister in law and my up and my um both my sisters. We went to this place called Crab Hut <clears throat> in Richmond, Virginia. When I tell y'all these crabs were so good and juicy and very inexpensive. If you in Virginia, in Richmond, and you like blue crabs, go to the crab hut. They do have a high star rating. They got like a 4.6 star rating. And it's totally worth it. Their crabs were so good. The shrimp, everything. We had got some shrimp. We got crabs. We got snow crab legs. And yeah, that was it. Shrimp, crab, uh, blue crab, and snow crab legs. So good. They were so good. So I can attest to that. So if you in Richmond... <clears throat> and you like blue crabs crab hut is where you want to check out mm. and that was my first and only time ever being in that place and I'm just saying that because service was wonderful crabs were delicious please go check them out if y'all can <clears throat> to do a crab video <clears throat> but the way I eat crabs people don't like that so I don't feel like all the negativity I'll just eat those off camera <laughs> cuz when I'm eating crabs I do not have time to be cute or I just like to eat them real messy. I'm sorry. And I got such, not all negative comments, but I got some criticism about that. So, uh, those would be my things that I just do off camera. Cause I love crabs. And I can go in. I might go live and eat them. That probably be the only time. Hmm. Y'all, this is coming so good. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. But. Yo, I'm going to get out of here. Thank y'all so much for joining me. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. All the nice comments and support and everything. I really do, y'all. And just make sure your bell is turned on so when I drop a new video, you will know. So, until the next time I see you guys, Make sure, as well as me, we're going to take care of our mind, we're going to take care of our heart, and we're going to take care of our soul. We're going to take care of us, so that way, we can take care of those around us that we love. So, until the next time I see y'all, bye! Mm -hmm.